Hurt people hurt people. This is a really common phrase, and what it means is that people who are hurt inside, people who are deeply wounded, who are not happy with themselves, they are the ones that are likely to lash out at other people and try to hurt them, try to make them feel bad about themselves. Nobody who really loves themselves, who love life, are going to go around and try to hurt other people's feelings, who are going to be judgmental towards them, who are going to try to make them feel terrible about themselves. No, only people who are really deep down hurt inside would want to do that. And it really shows a level of deep immaturity in a person who's going to do that as well. I watched a TikTok of a woman who is on the autism spectrum, I think much more higher functioning, and she was crying and sad and um, basically doing word displays, talking about how she is so traumatized, so deeply hurt, uh, destroyed inside, because all she is trying to do is help people build awareness about autism. And there's so many people in the comments that are making fun of her, making fun of her looks, making fun of her speech, making fun of her beliefs. What kind of sick, twisted individual would do something like that and actually try to hurt someone? Well, unfortunately, there's a lot of sick, twisted individuals that would do something like that. And of course, those people will show up on my TikTok comments as well, right? Every single video I do, I get dozens of these people who are very, you know, deeply hurt inside, you know, unhappy, d don't have a, a healthy love life, are incapable of creating it. And of course, I'm someone that could actually show them how to do it. But the first thing that they need to do is start being responsible with their triggers and, and be with that hurt feeling that comes up when they get information that they don't like. But instead of doing that, they can't handle it. So they have to lash out and they have to insult me so that they can very temporarily feel good about themselves again. Now, of course, when people make fun of my teeth or my hair or that I apparently don't have a wife, or that I'm homeless, or that I live with my mom, or whatever. I find it all amusing. I mean, I wish people would come up with more original insults and actually make me laugh, but but it, it's not a big deal because I'm a big boy. But most people on the receiving end of these kind of attacks are not going to be able to handle it very well, and it really is going to get to them. It really is going to hurt them. And the first step to getting everything that you want in your love life is to stop hurting other people when they bring up hurting you. Instead, when you feel that shame, you feel that anger, sit with it and be responsible.